Alright, in this Geek Tip video I'm going to show you how to get to and use the advanced boot options inside of Windows 11. In previous versions, Windows 7, Vista, XP, uh, you were able to get to the advanced boot options by pressing the F7 key at boot. But it doesn't work anymore for Windows 8, 10, and 11. So you actually have to allow the system to boot up partially to get to it. So I'm going to show you the two ways to get to it inside of Windows 11. First way is actually once you're logged into it and the second way is before you log in. So let's go ahead. We're actually logged into Windows 11 here. I'm going to show you how to do it here. So we're going to go to the start menu. We're going to go to settings. We're going to go scrolling down the system calm here until we get to recovery and then we're going to click on advanced startup we're going to click on restart now and we'll say restart now all right and here we are we are now into the advanced boot options menu so at this point in time we're going to go over here and we're going to click on troubleshoot this will actually get us to the actual advanced boot options we we'll click on troubleshoot and we go into advanced options and this is where we get the advanced boot options startup repair startup settings if you want to go into safe mode startup settings is where you go uh, bring up a command prompt uninstall the updates you can actually get into the bios here you can do it at system restore and you can also do a system image recovery so but now let's go ahead and let's go back over and let's go back into Windows 11 real quick and I'll show you how to do it from the boot menu or actually from the logon menu. Alright, here we come up. And there we go. All right, now here we are at the actual logon screen. So we're going to, uh, I'm just going to click here. I want to bring up the menus. So I want to show you how you do it. And it's a, it's a combination of key and mouse clicks. And so what I want to do is I'm going to bring up the on-screen keyboard. Make real your quick. computer easier to use. Yeah. Window on-screen keyboard. Let's bring up the on-screen keyboard real quick. I want to show you. So what we're going to do is you have to hold down the shift key while you press the power button you have to do it while you have to hold down the shift key and click on restart like that and there we go we're back into the uh, the advanced boot options again so that's basically how you go about getting into the boot options you go into troubleshoot your advanced options and pretty much can get quite a bit of uh, troubleshooting done uh, through the advanced boot options so for more geek tips go on over to geeksinphoenix.com and uh, that's it for today so you have a great day and we'll talk to you later